antiquity, India's beloved elephants have participated in work, processions, hunting, warfare, and in celebrations. They have always been a favoured subject of artwork. There are some 3,000 domestic elephants in India. They are not an unusual sight on the streets, around temples and at festivals. But many more elephants, about 30,000, are much more rarely seen, living their lives in the wild. In this meadow, near Aralam Wildlife Sanctuary, footprints show that they have recently passed. Pressure from India's human population means that wild elephants now occupy only 5% of their historic range. Asian elephants spend around 16 hours a day eating grass, brush and bark. They are an edge species. They do well just outside of forest boundaries. That means they may intrude on farmland and plantations. In areas like this one, Humans and elephants must jostle for space in an increasingly human-dominated landscape. This electric fence, powered by solar energy, is intended to keep elephants from intruding on the family's garden. Deeper in the protected forest, the elephants pose less danger to their human neighbours. A solitary and elderly tusker. Unlike their African cousins, only male Asian elephants have tusks. A calf grazes with its mother. For now, the grass is a supplement to breast milk. Calves remain with loosely connected clans composed mostly of adult females. Sometimes juveniles help take care of younger calves. The calves learn from their mothers to toss dirt on themselves to protect their skin from sun and insects. Today, wild elephants roam only a sliver of their once vast territory as human landscapes nudge against their ancient habitats. Achieving harmony between humanity and the wild will allow future generations to witness the magnificence that walks in the footsteps of India's past. Mm -hmm.